Howdy, howdy, and hello, everybody! Welcome back to Creation Corner here on the creative plot of the Emerald Isle. As you guys know, I am Husky Tails, your favorite green fluff ball. And as always, guys, we are here to show off your amazing creations. And as you guys remember, we are here to show off your nature themes. We are also joined by Purple Mushroom, Misty Cookie Hamster, the amazing new Blake GD with his awesome skin, Lovely Princess, Call Me Grande, I think. And I think there's one more other person, but they ran off ahead. So, we're gonna go ahead, guys. Head on over to here, see what magical mischief we can make. Oh, there they are, dog lover. So, guys, we're going to go ahead and start in our first entry, because the first entry, guys, is by... Our first entry, guys, is by AwesomeCraft005, who did this awesome little nature keeper with my Wonder Warrior orb. It looks like I have the power of nature. That would be an awesome ability, I think. Don't I mean, to control water and nature and all that it's amazing but I do love it it's very mystical and magical thank you so much for it awesome craft I look forward to hopefully seeing your next entry for next time all right guys up next right here for between cookie and dog lover we have we have contagious melon MC or CMMC who made me covered in all the wonderful nature creatures there's some bees ladybug butterflies uh, chickens, a uh, little look like a baby one on my head too, and of course enjoying the sunshine. I do love it. I, it's very well drawn, and I can't wait to see what else you make. Especially that cute little chicken right there. I love it on my head. I even have ears. But thank you again so much, Contagious Melon. Oh, I'm try. I, I promise that it will slow down. <laughs> I'm getting a little hyper, but I do hope to see what you make next time. All right, guys. Up next, right here. Hello, Mr. Rainbow Tiger. We have. We have Cookie Hamster who did a montage of their nature photos. You are an amazing photographer and I love seeing all these talents of yours. You see we have like a little sunset or sunrise. Got a flower right there, got some berries, a leaf, a dandelion, a bunny, more leaves, and of course your hamster's cage which is very well decorated. Your hamster is a very well treated hamster. But I do love your photography and I can't wait to see what you make next time. Thank you so much Cookie. All right, guys. Right here we have we have Ice Princess who made these awesome Minecraft flowers, as well as a picture of themselves in between all the flowers. There's two quick photos you'll be seeing here. It looks like they're amazingly well built because it's just a quick little creation world. It looks like, but I love it. The purple, pink, and red. I I, I gotta say I like it. I really do. I I I hope to. S oh, and actually, I just realized that you have flowers in your hair too. So it's kind of like two entries. <laughs> But thank you so much, Ice Princess. I can't wait to see what you make next time. All right. And sorry if I'm going a little faster than usual, guys. Um, we actually have some storms here, so I'm trying to hurry and get this before my power goes. <laughs> but guys, right here we have we have Kia Cat who drew a tree. It looks like it has like little ears on it, maybe, and it looks like I'm in the tree. I'm an adorable little chibi me. It's adorable. I love it so much. Thank you for the fun little tree, and I like little. I always like how you have like the, the graffiti spray splatter stuff. It's amazing. I love it so much. All right, guys, over here. Sorry, trying to take a deep breath. I'm trying. I'm trying not to go fast, but at the same time, I'm trying to go fast. <laughs> Hello, Blake. Hello. I do like your skin. Um, all right, guys. Up next, we have. We have the Rubycraft18 who drew an amazing picture of some trees, some rocks with a waterfall, some birds, and some flowers. I actually almost want to see if I can replicate this for my little hill in my or the little hill on my little balcony for my uh, survival world because it actually looks very wonderful. But I also saw you have like white nails too. Uh, thank you so much for that, Ruby. It is amazing. I can't wait to see what you make next time. All right, guys. Over here, we have. We have Scented Dreamer, who I believe is actually on their way to America right now. You're going to see this on Monday, but I hope you're having fun, Scented. Um, I, oh, I see the little creeper over there, too. So you, and this must be like Recreation World, <laughs> where you have all your entries. But I can see some bunnies. I can see your past creations. And I can see you're camping and having a nice time. Look at all that nature theme going on there. I love it so much. Thank you so much for it all, Scented. I hope you are having a good time here in America. All right, guys. Over here we have hello again. We have Taylor Cheshire who took a picture of them with this awesome texture pack in a survival world. It looks like now I don't know what the texture pack is, but I like the little experience bar it has sparkles and I like the grass. It looks very cool. And thank you so much for the picture too, because I like seeing what you guys do in your free time in your survival worlds. 
All right, guys. Up next. Oh, those ones are gone. How strange. That's very strange. That's okay, though. All right, guys. Up next, we have... We have the Anita 1217, who drew a picture of them in the woods with some foxes. And it looks like a baby one, too, and a little wolf in the background. At least I assume it's you. And so it has like some water there. And overall, it is very cool and very awesome. I got to, I do like the little details, and I like how you drew yourself and the foxes. It's very cute. Thank you so much for that. All right, guys. Up next, right here, we have... We have, and I hope I got this right, it's for a Twitter follower. They put, it's a X, it's rainbows with a Z, X. And they drew this fun picture of me. <laughs> looks like I'm getting wet by some flowers. It looks like there's a tree in the background with some apples. I like the little lighting you did on it. it looks like I'm sighing, and I had like a little butterfly on me. This, sometimes nature is fun, but when it's all wet and drippy like this, my ears do floppy get wet, and it's no fun. <laughs> Thank you so much for that, though. I do hope to see more entries from you in the future, and I hope I got your name right. Thank you so much. All right, guys. Right here, we have we have X Purple Mushroom X, who drew well, not drew, but took a picture of themselves in their world with some sunflowers, some sheepies, some pigs. I want to see if there's a chicken. I don't see a chicken, but I do see some more flowers in the back. It looks like there's some caves to explore. You're gonna have to let us know how this world was. But I love the that picture. It's amazing. I do like seeing all the creatures of Minecraft come together. It's always a fun thing to see, isn't it? Either way, thank you so much, Purple Mushroom. I hope to see more entries from you in the future. All right, guys, and with that, we, oh, wrong button. <laughs> with that, guys, we are done. Now, I know a lot of you guys are wondering, Husky, what's next week's theme? As you guys can see up here, this will be changing though here soon, um, because we've actually run out of room on our wall here. We've added all these rooms right here. You guys can see, here's our nature theme right here. Well, for week 22, guys, we are actually well, we, I am actually going to let you guys design a new look for our Puppy Pal Palace. For, uh, see, mostly for the Creation Hall area here because it's kind of small. We also need more places to put this stuff up. So, next week's theme, guys, is the Puppy Pal Palace. I want to see what you guys would think, what you guys want to see if it was to be rebuilt. I'm not saying it will be rebuilt, but if I was to rebuild it, what do you guys want to see? And, as you guys enter, this will be some, no, I like seeing all your guys' creations anyways, but... Some of the best entries will be used to be our new plot. I do plan to renovate here sometime soon. They may make a summer house of sorts. So guys, make sure to include a room for our creation corner. Make sure to include a room for all of our fun little item frames where we can put the themes that we've been having. Maybe a couple of rooms for some of our puppy pals who always come visit. Either way, guys, I want to see your amazing creations and ideas. And you can draw them or you can build them on Minecraft. Either way, guys, I want to see a nice little summer edition. And maybe we'll just, like, put a little platform above here and make it, like, a summer edition. <laughs> Either way, guys, next week's theme is the Puppy Pal Palace and what you guys would like to see done with it. Either way, though, guys, thank you so much for watching. Be sure to have an amazing week. Remember, you, yes, you, are an awesome person. And as always, guys, I will see you in the next video. Bye! With the colored blocks. <laughs> Bye!